Lifting family, welcome back. Here we are with another review, and this review is a sponsored review. So this review is sponsored by Blonix, and they have provided me with the option to choose a couple products that I could sample out. And what I wanted to do is just make sure that I actually use the products and use them not just for a day to get some sort of placebo effect and say, wow, this product is excellent. No, no. What I wanted to do is make sure that I use the products for a sufficient period of time before I could actually gauge their ability to work. So with that, I had the opportunity to then gauge the HMB here, which was the, it wasn't too bad in terms of taking it. I'm not really the best at taking things twice a day. So with this, I took three caps and I had to take that twice a day. So the three capsules ended up providing 1.5 grams of the HMB, so calcium HMB. And then it also has 195 milligrams of calcium in here. And there's 60 servings of three caps, which it is recommended to take six caps per day. So there is a total, there's a total of 60 servings in here. So you are recommended to take two servings per day. So we've got beta alanine. So with beta alanine, you can help boost muscle carnosine levels. So this is going to be another one that is a nice bonus. Now with beta alanine, one of the big things that people notice is that fun tingling effect. And for some people it is pronounced, other people it is subtle. Then there is the possibility that it's just non-existent. Generally, if it's non-existent, you don't feel the tingle. Purity, so that's really where Blonix tends to shine. They focus on product purity and product simplicity. And that's really what I enjoy. So with this, I definitely did notice some effects coming from the HMB, specifically this morning, just because I ended up leaving these here over the weekend to where I was not planning to delay the review this long, but given everything that's kind of gone on, that ended up happening and I wasn't able to take this Friday evening, Saturday full day, Sunday full day, and then this morning. So I just kind of felt a little bit less ready to go this morning. I couldn't really pinpoint what that was because my diet hasn't really changed. Not much has really changed, but the big thing would be that these two components were missing, so maybe that's saying something, maybe not, but at the same time, it definitely was one of those things where I work out at 5.30 in the morning. So in terms of the thought process or just me being like, well, I don't have my go juice, that's something that is not part of the picture. I'm not thinking about that in the morning. I am thinking about basically taking my, my dome shot of my pre-workout and then waiting a little while before I get started on my workout. Outside of that, I'm just trying to wake up. So I'm not really getting that, that hyped up placebo effect. As in two. Hello, ladies. What's up? I really enjoyed what, what came from, from this, and I also enjoyed the process just because during the delivery process, you're basically given updates as, as things travel along the way. So it let me know that the product had been in transit, it let me know that it was out for delivery, and then it let me know that it was delivered as someone who definitely tracks things like a hawk. So these two worked out really, really well. I didn't really say too much about the beta alanine just because with beta alanine, it's one of those things where it feels kind of like creatine and that was kind of the next big thing when, in, when this supplement had come out, when beta alanine had really hit the market. That was something that just, just really seemed to be like the next big thing next to creatine. But the problem with both of them is that the, the results tend to be a little bit more subtle to where you might get another rep in like the, the eight to 12 rep range that helps uh, be boosted from this. And then similar from the HMB as well. This one, I just kind of noticed, noticed a little bit more of like the want to move, the want to go, which was not something that I was expecting. But that was something where that's the nice thing about supplements is that if you are trying not to read too much into them, you can end up getting effects that you just were not expecting. The next piece that we have to go through here is going to be something that I did not get to try, which was the protein sample. So this is an egg white protein isolate and it is a chocolate flavor. The plan will basically be to mix this up in a shaker with eight ounces. Here is the packet. We can pop off that top seal. Time to mix this up. It has a good smell to it. Chocolate is kind of one of those hard things to miss in terms of the, the flavor. So if you've really messed up on chocolate, there's a problem. So the flavor is a little bit light. I do enjoy the flavor. I 
when I was younger, I was preferring things that were flavor heavy. I wanted something that was pretty strong in flavor. That way I could hopefully take care of some cravings and I would just kind of want, I'd be craving just that. I'd be craving protein or I'd be craving specifically in this instance, the Blonix uh, egg white protein isolate. So with this, the flavor is pretty light, which I'm actually enjoying. It tends to, for me, now mean that it's not going to settle hard in my stomach. So I definitely like it. Uh, smooth taste overall. I'm not really noticing any clumps. There's a little bit of froth on top, which is kind of a nice positive rather than seeing a bunch of this clumpiness where the protein didn't actually break up. A little bit of froth still in the end, but for the most part, all taken down. No weird faces, which tells you that I'm being honest here. And outside of that, I really appreciate Blondix for reaching out to me. I would definitely try these products. I would rate them as a five star out of five star. The HMB specifically is something that I will be trying again. Blonix, thank you for reaching out to me and offering me this opportunity for the review. As always, remember to click that like button. Turn on notifications, click that bell. Subscribers have been going up, but the big thing, if you forget to turn on the bell, you don't know when new videos land. Comment below if you have any questions. Subscribe, please remember to subscribe. Just because subscribers have been going up does not mean that I don't need your support still. I appreciate all of you supporting me. It helps with opportunities like this for this channel. And then you also get exposure in terms of being able to see reviews like this to decide whether or not this is something for you. Thank you for watching and as always, keep pushing.